Hello, my strippers. My name is Marlene McCohen, and this is Leo. You all know Leo, right? Well, today's a really exciting day for Leo and I, and for you guys, because we are going to do an unboxing. An unboxing? Yeah, we're gonna unbox something exciting today. Now, before I tell you about it, do you remember Favorites Friday? I've done that a few times. Well, I think it's about time that I get on top of Favorites Friday. Maybe not every Friday, but as much as I possibly can. And it may not be bird product, but it may. Here's why I'm so excited though. You guys are joining me in my YouTube studio. It's like 85% set up. So I'm really excited to have you guys here because as you'll notice, I have my backdrops up. So today we're going with blue. Now guess what I have to show you guys today. I'm really excited about it because I'm a bird person and you guys are bird people. And even if you don't have a bird and you just like my channel, here's a great way to start with birds without the commitment. So look at what I have today. I have this window bird feeder by Camaleo's Garden. Oh, Camaleo. Leo likes that. Isn't he so chill, guys? He's like the chillest bird. He's gonna be like my unboxing bird. So before we even open this and take a look, check this out. You see all these birds? These guys could be hanging at your window. So if you want a parrot, but you can't get a parrot, or maybe you can't commit to a parrot, you could kind of have some little visitors outside your window. What do you think, Leo? Leo likes looking outside the window. So let's unbox it. Dun, dun, dun. I hope I'm as graceful at unboxing as I am at wrapping presents. Dun, 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 dun. Ooh, okay. This is really cool because look at how transparent it is. This is sticking up, but it's just a simple piece. Oh, you put it together. Actually, it's removable. That's nice. This way you can clean it. I like this. It's so transparent. You could totally see everything that the birds are doing through your window. You could even see my ring light. That just proves how nice and clean it arrives. Okay, let me show you a few things about this. The first thing that I think is important to know is that it's not glass. It looks like glass, but it's not. It's basically acrylic, so it's 100% safe. It's not gonna fall, crack, break, or anything like that. You don't have to worry about it around your children or in earthquakes or any other dramatic situations that I can think of living in California, you know? That's pretty exciting. The best thing about it is that you can see all the birds and what they're doing and all the fine details of their little busy lives, something that I love doing, and Leo, could be on his stand looking outside and checking the birds out. Right, Leo? Oh, yes. Here's what else. Okay, so this tray is removable. I love this. If you're a clean freak like me, you're gonna be excited to not have to take a whole thing and empty it out and be awkward. You could just pull this piece out and fill it up with water and food. There's a few holes in these two. So I'm gonna say you put the water in the middle and you put the seeds in here, which is cool because you get a choice of two different kinds of seeds if you'd like. Or you could just stick with the same side and not have the birds fighting over it. Or you could attract different birds depending on what you put in your feeder. These holes are actually important. They're drain holes. They help keep your seed nice and fresh which is always a really good thing to prevent it from growing mold and build up. So the birdies always have something nice and fresh to eat. Don't forget to change the seeds, by the way, because, you know, if they get used to coming to visit you, they're going to be expecting some food. They're going to be like, why is this restaurant closed? You got to keep the restaurant open. You know what I mean? So you fill it up with your seeds. You put the tray in. Very simple. Not for me, but simple. And then they have this nice little rubber perch that they could just sit on all nice and comfortably so that we could get double action, some action up here, some action down here. I'm really excited about this action that's about to happen, by the way. And another really good thing about the acrylic is that it's weather durable. So I was worried about earthquakes because I don't even think about rain here. But yeah, if you live where it rains, this is extremely durable and weatherproof, so remember that. Actually, yesterday I was just talking to my cousin in New York and I said, hey, something's at my window and she's like, what? 
And I'm like, I have no idea. It sounds like tiny little leprechauns tap dancing. And she's like, go find out what it is. I'm like, I'm going to. And then I go to uncover the mystery and I open my back door. And there it is, rain. Yeah, that's how much it doesn't rain here. I forgot. I forgot. Like literally, if it thunders, I'm expecting the apocalypse. So apocalypse or not, or if you live in sunny California, this is just perfect. Oh, now we have these little pieces here. These are the suction cups. Oh, that's probably another good reason that it's acrylic is because it's lightweight. So you want it to attach to the window. Let's see how easy this is even with my skills. Good news, there's four of these and three holes. So if you lose one, so all you do is you put the suction in and then you push it up. That's perfect. And once it's stuck to the window with the weight, it's going to stay there. And in case your parrot eats things, you know, you have an extra one. Let's see what it says. Oh, soften the suction cups before attaching them to the feeder holes. You moisturize them with one drop of water. I was like, how do I soften them? But yeah, you moisturize them with a drop of water and then you clean the window. And you stick them to the window and then you expect birds. Now, if you guys are confused about what kind of food, I have that all prepared too. Any finch food will do. Of course, depends on what kind of birds you want to attract. I got this finch food here because I have finches. Actually, my finches kind of have different food, but I did get this one at the store just for this. You know why I got this one, actually? I got this one because it didn't have a whole bunch of fake ingredients. So basically, what I would do is open the bag like so. Ooh, I need a little scooper. Well, for the purpose of this video, let's put some seeds in here. Grab a few, put them in here. Maybe that wasn't the best thing to do right here. Okay, well, we just learned something. Better to keep this in here when you're putting the seeds in if you're doing it in your house. Oh, they still come out. Okay, that's okay. okay that leaves word for the birds where to go. So you put the seeds in there. You put more than that in. I just uh, got a little like, mm, got to clean up right now. And then we'll try putting it on the window. Let's do that together. Okay, here we go. I'm half tempted to put it on this side. These guys are walking their dog. Hey guys, do you want to be in my vlog? Oh, the moon is full. I'd like to put it here in my YouTube room. See if I could catch any birds. Um... Moisten the suction cups. I have never been good at suction cups. I gotta pull this down so that it's hanging on it. Ooh, what do you guys think? Do you think I'm gonna catch some birds here? I think it looks nice and clean. It feels really sturdy. That was very simple. Let's put some food in it now. Now I can pull this out. How about I do that? Perfect. That should be good. So I filled it up probably like a quarter of an inch and then I'll get a cup and put water in here. Now, of course, we got to put that back. We put it in here just like that. Looking good. Now let's see if we can catch some birds. See what it looks like from the glass. My dog thinks someone came in. This is what it looks like. Pretty clean. I'm expecting a hawk to arrive any moment. Just kidding. And the good news is that Leo is going to be 100% entertained by any birds that he should find. Right, Leo? That was really cool. I'm excited to see what happens there. But I have even better news for you guys. Our friends at Camel Leo's Garden have decided to give you sniffers Yes, you guys, 70% off if you want to buy this. So if you love birds, this is going to be really fun for you. If you don't have a bird yet and you kind of want to not commit to a bird outside who can kind of take care of himself, not naming names, doesn't need kisses like this guy, then I think you'll really enjoy this. So read my description. I love those of you that read. Reading is everything. Read my description. Yeah, he says yeah. And check out the code below and enter that code into the link that I provide. What is your deal? No. You see, wouldn't it be so much better to have little finches outside than a big Amazon trying to get into your mouth? What happened? I have uh, advertised you as the chillest bird in the world. Oh, I'm not gonna lie, I love it. Okay, stop. 
So check out the link below, read the description, find the code, enter it, and you are on your way to bird watching. And on a different note, if you guys want more Favorites Friday, let me know in the comments. Please subscribe, we love new subscribers. I don't know what Leo is doing, but he has decided to act out for you guys today. Oh no, Leo's becoming a Cody. Remember Cody on my head? Remember when Cody was like the chillest bird and then like now he's not? I don't know what's gonna happen here. Mm. Guys, I still can't believe that I have Leo. This is crazy. I'm excited about Leo. I'm excited about this backdrop and my little YouTube room. I'm excited about life. I'm excited about you guys. So please join in on the fun, subscribe, and stay tuned for Storytime Sunday, because that's coming up next, and it's a really, really good one. I haven't even edited it yet, but I know, because I know what it's about. Ooh, wet willy. Not gonna lie, I kinda like that. Okay, on that note, we better go. I love you guys so much, thank you so much. <laughs> Bye, guys.